Hello, what is up YouTube? This is Amar and today we have the brand new 2021 Grand Cherokee L. Finally got this beautiful and amazing car. In today's version we have the Limited. Before I start this video, I just wanna give a huge shout out to Chrysler Jeep Ram dealership for making today's happen. I'm gonna put their information down in the description so you guys can go and rock with them. They do have tons of inventory. Long story short, go rock with them. Let's just start this video. This is not the Jeep that we are used to. In fact, it's a bit longer, a bit fancier. I would say a bit better. This is the all new redesigned Grand Cherokee L Limited. So what is new with the Grand Cherokee L? I would say everything from the new LED headlights with the day running lights that is giving it a very special glow to the LED fog lights that is located right under it. Chrome touches all over it. And let's not forget the Jeep signature grill as well. A lot of venting in the front for a better look. Then the hood that is completely different design. In conclusion, the new design is pretty cool. Leave a comment down below if you agree with me. What will you get if you buy the Grand Cherokee L Limited? First, an 18 inch standard fully painted aluminum wheels. You have another option which is a 20 inch 8.5 polished slash painted aluminum wheels. A chrome line that starts all the way from the mirror and it keeps going all the way to the back of the car for a better glow. And you do have the option to have 6 seats or even 7 seats for your beautiful family. A cool looking back design and an LED taillights, also redesigned. Couple of badges around like the L and the 4x4 in chrome touch. A heading toe on hook behind this plastic. And pay attention to details, you have chrome even in the back under the sensors. It's absolutely beautiful. And this is the key. Unlock and lock button, open the back trunk, start and stop remotely and the panic mode. Let's open the back and show you the space. And here it is. I put one chair down just to give you an idea of how it looks with one chair up and one chair down. It's really spacious and you do have space in here as well. Where I have hidden my crime, I put all the plastic bags in here. Don't tell no one. 
And whenever you feel like, just pull that chair down like this. And yes, this car is very spacious. You can also put the, the second row too. And to get them back, just pull them up. Very simple. Fix the headrest and you're good to go. This is the button to close the door. You have some lights, speaker in the back, and some hooks on your right. 12V on your right. A lot of hooks in this car. And some little storage area right here. This is about it in the back. Let's just close this thing up. I am in love with this design, guys. It's, it's so cool. It just looks super cool, in my opinion. Hey, why don't we go to the inside? Let's go. So guys, here we are inside of the Jeep and like I explained to you guys, this is all leathered up. I really love the new design of the steering wheel. It's impressive what they did. You have a wood design in here, the Jeep badge in here. You have your cruise controls up in here. This is all the buttons for it. And this is the menu controls in here. And this button is super cool. Watch what it does. It lets you choose what do you want to show up in here. Look at that. That's really cool. This is your dashboard. This is how it looks. So the steering wheel is really amazing. You do have your shifting paddles in here. What I really like is that everything here is all leathered up. This is really soft leather. And here is the buttons for the car's automatic brakes. This is the lane assist. This is the, uh, the traction mode. And this is the parking sensors. This is the infotainment system. It looks really amazing. You have a lot of controls, absolutely. Make the whole thing as a map if you want to. You have your phone controls, the vehicle controls. This is really amazing. I wanted to show you something. You see, I don't know if you guys can see it, but this black thing in the middle, this is actually a camera that shows the second and the third row. Have, let's see it. Exactly, it shows you. This is me right here. Hi. Yeah, it shows you the back, the middle, and a little bit of the front, which is amazing. It just turned that off. And the rear view camera is not bad. It's actually really good. And the touch screen is super responsive. This is for the AC controls. Have heated seats, ventilated seats. The navigation, of course, like I explained before. Put down here, this is the buttons for the climate controls. Volume, you can press it like this, it's open. You have a little bit of storage and your USB and USB-C chargers. And of course, the 12V charger right here. And this is my favorite. I love the gear selector that they put like this. This is really amazing. And the quality is so good. I can. I can feel it's the metal it's beautiful and this button right here is for the car mode so you do have the car modes let me show you so look you have a little bit of animation so this is just auto sport you see how you have a little bit of lights in here that's impressive sport snow sand or mud look at that that's traction control off or on now let's talk about the super cool things that can add up to this car available full color 10 inch heads up display that shows turn by turn navigation speed and so much more and night vision camera thermographic technology and infrared sensors that can scan pedestrian and animals up to 100 yards and a beautiful ambient lighting That's amazing, you guys. Now, let's go to the back. And before I go to the back, I just want to show you the sticker. Feel free to pause the video at any time to read the options that you can have with this car. I'm gonna go as slow as I can. See? So the base price of this car is 45,995. And with all of these standard options and added option, it comes to 53,665. Let's go to the back, guys. And this is the seats in the back. <laughs> they are super soft. And let's get in. Uh, this is the legroom that you 
have in this car. You do have a back climate controls too. Just turn it off for now. And you do have your USB and USB-Cs. This is the space. And in terms of the headroom, you do have a lot of headroom. I mean like this much of headroom. And let's not forget, you do have a back row. Let's go to the back row, guys. Let me show you how you can do that. You can do it two ways. Either have this one like this. There is also another way, and I think it's an easier way. Just do this. The seat will pull up just like this for you to get in. <clears throat> oh my God. Honestly, the back space is not bad at all. I do have a lot of leg room. I mean, an adult can stay in the back comfortably, honestly. Look. Wow, this is really impressive. I didn't know it was gonna be this much room, honestly. I thought it was gonna be a little bit of room. You do have your cup holders, USB, USB-Cs. They never forget about the people sitting all the way in the back. You guys still have attention in this car, so yes. And the seats are exactly the same seats as the front and the back row. That's really soft and I really love the seats actually. This car is super, super, super comfortable. This is the camera I showed you earlier. Yes, and this is the view that you can see sitting in this car. That's really, really, really cool guys. Why don't we take this car for a drive? It's really easy to get out and to get in of this car actually. This car is super spacious. I never imagined I would be saying this. Usually back rows are very tight, but not in this car. Whew, amazing. So guys, we are about to take this car for a drive. Here's one last look and let's go. Man, this car looks really amazing. And let's just put the seat belt on. I'm going to do the car different modes for you guys. So let's start with the auto mode. So auto mode. I want to show you. This car sounds really amazing, guys. I just want to point that out. And the turning is so amazing. And it shows you right here on the screen. You're going downhill, going uphill, you know, it shows you all of that information down in the, in the gauge cluster, which is amazing. The sound is incredible. So an auto would just reach the road for you and it just adjusts the suspension according to the road. And this is amazing. Let's try the sport mode. Wow, the sport mode is amazing in this car. This is really responsive. Let's try to do it with this one. You hear that? That's impressive to me. And uh, let's go. sounds incredible it sounds incredible i have to say that it sounds amazing i love the way how it drives you don't feel the weight in this car it feels so light and like i said the leather in this car is so great everything about this car is really amazing and you get to the driving part and that's when you go holy this car is perfect and I just love having fun with the sport mode let me show you the difference so we are in auto mode again okay I did not shift there I forgot you can use these shift paddles even when you are on the auto mode That's really great.
That's really amazing. So the sound, even if you drive it in sport or in natural or auto, still sounds amazing. Let's put it in sport too. That's impressive. It's so responsive, you guys. Yeah. And the sound is so amazing. This car is fast, sporty, it sounds really amazing in all different modes. But if you want to have the fun, then sport mode is the best for you. In conclusion, this is what we have been waiting for. It's definitely worth the 53 grand. In fact, it's luxury interior feels like an $80,000 or maybe $100,000 car. It's amazing, it's super fun to drive and very smooth for the long rides. It's also pretty cool for the eyes. If you want to take your family on a very comfortable ride and maybe have fun driving it by yourself, then this car is definitely for you. I myself have thought about getting me one. This is truly, truly amazing. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button and subscribe to support my YouTube channel. And it would be really helpful if you guys give me feedback so I can do better on my upcoming videos. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.